automatically a friend of mine. This is the military project, gentlemen. Can you state your business? Detectives, Phelps and Biggs, LAPD. We're investigating the explosion. We have reason to believe there may be a link to Hughes Aircraft. I'm sorry, I can't help you there, detective. Without authorization from Military HQ, you won't be allowed onto this facility. What seems to be the problem, gentlemen? Your face? Hey, Biggs. You're not still with the LAPD. Right so, mates. Can you help us out here? Sure. What seems to be the problem? We're working the big explosion at the electroplating plant. We found a part there that belongs to one of your planes. I work head of security for Mr. Hughes now. I'll take full responsibility. I'm sure we can clear this up. Follow me. It's the big hangar. You can't miss it. All right. Who is Mapes? And what's his connection to Howard Hughes? Vernon Mapes used to work advice. Word is he runs fuckpads for Hughes' starlets. A pimp. Earl and Mapes would seem. Mapes was the role model for creeps like Earl. <laughs> Let's do a little trick for him. <laughs> hold on, hold on one second. Guy. Can I... Oh, no, 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 don't get out yet. Uh, how can I look back? How can I... Ah, oh, fuck it. All right, let's let's do it like this. All right, there we go. Try to get out now, bitch. Yes, get out of the car, please. Thank you. Follow me. Will do. We shall follow you to the end of the earth. Photography of this air area. Good day, miss. Oh, hello there. Yes, yes, let's go. Can that thing really fly? Mr. Hughes believes so. Amazing, isn't she? So, this is the spruce coop. Jesus Christ, Biggs, you want to get me fired? Mr. Hughes hates that fucking man. It's the H4 Hercules to you. You mind answering a few questions, Mr. Mapes? Call me Vernon, kid. Fire away. Investigation, ah, uh, no, not investigation, but interrogation, go. Former Air LAPD officer and Hughes aircraft head of security. Nicholson, Nicholson plant explosion. Do you know anything about the explosion that happened at Nicholson electroplating this morning? No more than anyone else. Heard the boom while I was shaving. Almost shit my pants. That's Thought great. I pearl all over again. Doubt. But you had no personal contact with any of the employees. And you have no idea what caused the explosion. I'm in security. I handle Mr. Hughes's personal interests, if you get my meaning. I'm not directly involved in manufacturing. That was easy. He he instantly looked up. Knowledge of Okamoto. Do you know Tamako Akamoto? Never heard of the broad. Why? Oh ho 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 ho. That's either a lie or a doubt, cause. Hold on, let me let me check this. Let me check this. Yep, I I didn't say that it was a she. So, you just screw, screwed yourself over there. Let's see what lie says. Akamoto is an industrial spy. She's on your payroll. A spy, you say? That's very interesting. You have some way of proving she was working for me or Hughes. Oh, could it be this? Could it be this? It could be this. Fuck, now I want to pick that. Because he's retired. This guy. Man, I was gonna pick doubt because I didn't say that it was a she and she, he, the guy was like, I don't know her or whatever. But now I want to pick, pick this. Hmm. It's nothing personal. I'm just doing my job. You understand that? 
Yeah, former LAPD officer. Ah, former. Did he retire? God damn it. Now I want to pick that. I wish I had in intuition points. Fuck. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll go with this. I'll... Please be correct. Fuck! Damn it. Intriguing case you have here, Biggs. Spies, explosions, Howard Hughes. You could make a movie out of this one. Damn it. Uh, I should not have checked the lies things. I could have just picked doubt, and that would have been it. Knowledge of McClellan. Do you know the chief chemist at Nicholson Electroplating, a Harold McClellan? I've heard of the guy. He was pitching some fancy process to the company. Once again, he's looking around. Um, I don't. I don't think that I can doubt. Uh, no, I mean, uh, mm, nope. I'll just go with doubt. How? Have a contract with Nicholson. Hey, kid, lose the tone. Hughes has contracts with every plating shop in L.A. Are, are you serious? He was looking around so much. <laughs> this kid's a riot, Biggs. See Howard Hughes? Harry Truman has to make an appointment to see Howard Hughes. Thanks for your help, Mr. Mapes. Do you mind if we have a look around while we're here? Sure. Knock yourself out. I'd rather not knock myself Wanna out. Take a look inside her? And her. But like he was looking around so much. <clears throat> that was annoying. Hmm. McClellan's process was going to replace all this. Huh. So they dropped the bomb. Or or a plane. Ah, all the banging. Annoying. There is nothing here. Great. What great? Latitude 24 degrees 15 minutes north, longitude 76 degrees 0 minutes west. Uh, is that supposed to ring a bell? Oh, I guess we're gonna check it. 76 degrees west. 24 degrees 15 minutes north. Uh, what was that? Could you could you repeat that? Seventy six degrees west. Twenty four degrees fifteen minutes north. Twenty three was that? Here? Seventy six degrees west. Twenty four degrees fifteen minutes north. 76 degrees west. Ah, 76 degrees west. 15 minutes north. Is it supposed to be this? 24 degrees, 15 minutes north. 24, 15. Let's oh. see where this is exactly. The Bahamas? Somebody's already got their maiden flight planned. I was going for 23.15 with 24... Uh, not 23.15, of course. Which, it was, uh... 24.15, not 
I don't think there's anything else here. I don't think so. Did I miss anything? Nope. Alright. Back down we go. Can I still look around here? This is a big fucking place. Uh, can I go up there? Let's see if there's anything on the actual plane itself and not inside it. Music's still going, so that means that this is a part of it. I don't think there's anything here. Nope. Probably not. Hmm. Um... This is a little confusing because it's such a big place. That just goes back up onto the plane. Get a load of these engines. You think that cone could have come off one of them? Oh. Is that a Pratt and Whitney 4360? Sure is. You know your motors. Do you mind if I take a look at the prop spinner? We're getting her ready for sea trials, so be quick about it. What's the oily covering on the metal? Uh, we coat the aluminum parts in linseed oil to preserve it from oxidization. Stop it with the banging. Seriously. Looks like Mape's office is in the far corner. Let's go see what he's hiding. Is that it for these things? Uh, where is it? Over here, I believe. Aha! What is this? Love the fact that he just barges in there and does whatever. Took a smarter man than me to connect that. And then this is probably going to be the same result. Maybe. Yes. No. No. Oh, well, let's check out the lady. Damn. That is Marie the Body McDonald. This was born. <laughs> does Hughes have her on contract to RKO? Yeah. I bet he does. This was, uh, this was horn back then. Something, something, second street. And that's it. Let's see what Pinker has for us. He's probably done tinkering with that camera by now. Uh, down from here. Return to Wilshire, sta Wilshire Station. Thanks for the tour, Mapes. Always happy to help the department. Hey, don't I know your face from the papers? You're the cop that's stripping that German broad. Nah, I think you got the wrong guy, Vernon. <laughs> I don't know what that was uh, supposed to do. Well, hello there. But uh, we're going to be heading out back to the station. Oh, and I got to move my car. You know the way. You can drive. All right. Where to? How do we... Oh, you can't set it as destination. All right. Back downtown. You're not going to be able to get in. <laughs> you're not going to be... Oh, shit. You're a magician. 
I never so knew McClellan that. Was selling his new process to Hughes and cutting out Nicholson. Looks that way. This would never go all the way up to Hughes. We would have middlemen deal with stuff like this. Someone like Mapes? The word middleman was invented for guys like Mapes. Sure it was. Odd Man Out. Premiere tonight. Continuous daily from 2 p.m. And we're back to the station to see if if someone has something for us, a lead or anything. I don't want no part. Captain finds out we're dead. Uh, do I talk to you? No, there's no one there. Do you think this looks just too light for my complexion? Any messages for me, Hopkins? Not many you'd want to hear. Newspapers wanting interviews and rookies cussing you out, mostly. <laughs> Nothing else. Pinker wants you in tech services. Maybe you'll be more popular downstairs. Wow. Hey, fat. Fuck. You're going bold. That's that's the only thing that I gotta say to you. There's the exit. And downstairs. Over hey, here. You're not winning any popularity contests upstairs, you know. Yes, why don't you rub it in a little bit more? Where do you stand? I think you're a good cop, but I try and stay out of politics. Everybody tries to stay out of politics, Ray. Well, don't quote me on it. But I'm hoping that Parker will get the job and clean this place up. I have your photographs. Beat her up so bad. You can use the magnifier. There's quite a lot of detail. Can I can I select it? Thank you. Very funny. What? I think you're right, right? We have our man. We take a nice photo, Phelps. Oh, zoom in. Um Yeah, I don't I don't think there's anything here. Let's check the next. That bum took a swipe at me. I put him down with my staff. Um. Oh, the watch. The watch. I'm bringing the watch or a match for our John Doe. He's obviously the competitive bit. Can you get this over to Lockheed so we can get a name for this guy? It's already on its way. Yes. That was awesome. You know you made it if you get that guy. All right. Let's check out the next peck shop. Howard Hughes, millionaire, industrialist, aviator, and playboy, and Vernon Mapes, ex-dirty cop and business fixer. It was his. It was his. I found a similar tie pin along oh. the dead.